hello how to solve for m and n in this equation m plus n is equal to 2 then m n is equal to 4 m plus n is equal to 2 let's call this equation 1 m n is equal to 4 let's call this equation 2 now from this equation 1 m plus n is equal to 2 we make m the subject of the formula m is equal to 2 minus n now let's substitute this m is equal to 2 minus n into our equation 2 which is mn is equal to 4 from 2 mn equal to 4 then when m is equal to 2 minus n we have 2 minus n bracket n equal to 4 let's open the bracket 2 multiplied by n this is 2 n then minus n multiplied by n that is minus n square equal to 4 let's bring this 4 to this side we have 2 n minus n square minus 4 equal to 0 then let's rearrange this by multiply all through by minus 1 we have n square minus 2 n plus 4 equal to 0 this is a quadratic equation which can be solved using quadratic general formula and from quadratic general formula we have n is equal to minus b plus or minus square root of b square minus 4 ac then over 2a and from this equation a equal to 1 b equal to minus 2 then c is equal to 4 you can substitute here you have n is equal to minus bracket minus 2 plus or minus square root of minus 2 square minus 4 multiplied by 1 multiplied by 4 over 2 multiplied by 1 n is equal to minus times minus 2 that is 2 plus or minus square root of minus 2 square that is 4 then minus 4 times 1 times 4 that is minus 16 over 2 multiplied by 1 that is 2 n is equal to 2 plus or minus square root of 4 minus 16 that is minus 12 over 2 then n is equal to 2 plus or minus square root of minus 12 can be written as 4 multiplied by 3 multiplied by minus 1 over 2 we know that square root of minus 1 equal to i and here we have n is equal to n is equal to 2 plus or minus square root of 4 multiplied by root 3 multiplied by i over 2 then n is equal to 2 plus or minus square root of 4 that is 2 root 3 i over 2 then a uh, 2 here 1 2 here 1 2 here 1 n is equal to 1 plus or minus root 3 i therefore n1 is equal to 1 plus root 3 i and then n2 is equal to 1 minus root 3 i we've got the value of n let's solve for m using equation 3 from equation 3 because from here this is our equation 3 m is equal to 2 minus n we have m equal to 2 minus n then m1 will be equal to 2 minus 
1 plus root 3i. Then m1 will be equal to 2, if you open the bracket, minus 1, minus root 3i. Now, m1 will be equal to 1 minus root 3i. Also, for m2, m2 is equal to 2 minus n2. Then, m2 is equal to 2 minus 1 minus root 3i. M2 is equal to 2 minus 1 plus root 3i. Then M2 is equal to 1 plus root 3i. Therefore, M1 comma N1 is equal to 1 minus root 3i comma 1 plus root 3i then m2 comma n2 this is equal to 1 plus root 3i comma 1 minus root 3i so this is the final answer